Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Craft the World. We will be continuing our little empire of dwarves here, the kingdom of Earthbringers, making them the best kingdom we can make. A couple things I want to accomplish today. I want to go ahead and finish up the basic weaponry and basic processing and probably move on to basic fortification. Our base here is kind of lacking, and we got a big attack coming here in 25 minutes. So we'll stay nice and top, stay on top of that. And I also noticed that we can uh, get ourselves, where's that, a wooden staff for our mage. So let's go ahead and queue that up and get that made. So we're going to need a little bit more for basic weaponry. So let's go ahead. Uh, we don't have enough for a bow. Um, let's see what else can we do for basic weaponry. Well, maybe we'll have to make a couple more of the steel club. So let's go ahead and make, we'll make two more of those and then maybe we can make a quiver. Um, yeah, we can make 20 arrows. That's getting us pretty close. Mm, man, I really wish we could make that bow. Anyways, we'll let them get working on that and we'll go ahead and clear this out, cut that bush down and cut these trees down and gather some of those resources. So that's what we want to do today. We want to get our mage squared away here, which we should have any second. Looks like they made one of the maces. And we're churning out some arrows over there as well. And keep expanding our kingdom. Now that you've made it this far, or probably about a minute, minute and a half into the video, I'm going to do a little giveaway. I have a free copy on Steam of State of, the Get State of Decay Year One Survival Edition. So if you want that, let me know down in the comments below, uh, and I will send that to you. Uh, this is my first giveaway, so we'll see how that goes. And it looks like we went ahead and finished basic weaponry. Go us. All right, so now we're going to go into basic fortification. Looks like we got some simple fences, wooden traps, wooden cage, wooden spike, a beware sign, and a research book. So let's go into crafting here, and we're going to make ourselves... Well, let's make one of each. We'll make a, a simple wooden fence, and then we'll make a wooden trap. Uh, what do we need for a cage? We need rope, which we don't have, and we'll go ahead and make some spikes. Uh, and that is putting us up a little higher, and we'll go ahead and drag that down there. We'll take the traps and put the traps there. Let's take the spikes, put those guys there. And I guess we'll make um, a couple more spikes. Let's just finish up basic fortifications there. Good. Yay. Go us. All right. We're going to close out. Let's go ahead and slap these bad boys down and see what it looks like. We'll start with some spikes, I guess. Yeah, we'll put two spikes there and then maybe a, a fence. I don't think that's going to stop our guys, our doors. Let's see. They're still easily passing that. And then we'll put some wooden traps down and then maybe another fence. And then let's just, yep, we protected our home. Go us. And then we'll go ahead and put the last of these spikes down. Uh, and we'll put one there and that's um there we go we're protecting our kingdom of Earthbringers there with some wooden spikes and traps and i think obviously as we progress we'll get get a little better it looks like we got ourselves a new package let's go open that package up and we'll need to uh, go ahead and open that hatch and what do we got here looks like some christmas things we got a, a santa uh shirt and maybe some water bottles okay uh they'll get up there and pick that up for us and once they bring that down let's take a peek see at it all right, that's uh, into our inventory. Let's go ahead and well, let's check out equip here. Uh, so the mage staff is done. So let's find our mage here. We'll equip him. All right, so Nain, looks like you're going to be equipped with that mage staff. All right, and then let's check out Santa's coat, 40 armor, but you lose 18 agility. Well, um, Nain shouldn't need to be running around a lot, so he's going to be getting Santa's coat, and I don't know what those water bottles were. Let's go check out the crafting screen. Maybe it's under resources here. Uh, nothing there. Nothing there. It looks like a water bottle. We've got a trap we can build here. Ooh, the fishing rod. Definitely want to come back and build that in a second. Bucket of worms. Uh, the fishing book. What do we got under furniture? Ooh, we could build a Christmas tree. The Rudolph statue, statue, some garland, a Christmas wreath. What do we got here? A frogolisk house. Let's check out uh, this house. You're training a pet that helps the doors to. Oh, okay. Definitely going to want to come back. Owlcat 
and an imp house. Okay, this is snowman. So we captured the snowman frogs, it looks like. Ooh, okay. And then let's, uh, we can do grilled fish and that. All right, so I think what we should do, let's go ahead and clear off some of these trees here. And maybe we put some defenses over here. Now, there was a new one. Uh, let's go check that out. We could do scaffolding. We got the wooden bridge, which we might need to come back and change. The trap, we need rope. We still don't have any good source of rope yet. Let's cut these trees down so they're not on our trap like that. And we'll gather those bushes up there. All right, so those are being chopped down. So let's go ahead and go into crafting here. Can't really build that yet. So let's go ahead and we'll just build, let's build like two or three more of the spikes. And we'll just put those spikes right there to protect us on that side. And then we're going to close that hatch so the water is not going all the way down here into the bottom. Ignore that. Still need to clear this, uh, all these piranha plants out here and here. And we'll get to that here in a little bit. I want to get that fishing pole. So let's go back to crafting and fishing pole. God, we need rope, um, which we need wool for. All right, let's go find it well, right there. We're going to kill that sheep and take that wool from him. Um, let's see if there's another sheep somewhere. Looks, sounds like we're being attacked. Oh, we got some goblins coming through. So let's not do that. Looks like we're handling the goblins pretty well with their, their Christmas hats. Yeah, you chase that goblin. Nice. And here's the goblin. <laughs> uh, Santa's crash sleigh there. All right, we'll run over here and knock all the goblins out. And we'll take that sheep. There's our mage zapping away. Glad we got him that staff. Zappity zap zap he goes. So if you missed it at the first part of the video, don't forget to comment if you want a free copy. Ooh, and we're getting another dwarf of State of Decay Year One Edition. I got one copy to give away. So if you're that lucky person to watch this video per first and comment, you'll be uh, getting here soon. All right, looks like we got a skeleton army coming this way. Let's go ahead and get our doors wiping them out looks like we're doing a pretty good job that mage is just zappity zap zap away grunt shop we need to visit here soon and collect some resources from that we got uh wait what some weird dragon thing where did he come from did he just kill a dwarf fire so it looks like our mage is zapping him but i think he killed a dwarf because he is he is really doing some damage to us. Um, okay. Um, yeah, run away. Don't get hurt. Is he going to land on the spikes? Uh, how do we beat this fellow here? It's not even the time for the... Alright, they're getting in there doing some attacks. But he is just cooking us alive. Alright, almost gone. So he passed out. Low health. We're gonna, oh, we should, um, let's do some healing here. Let's go to this and just start using some band-aids. Get everyone healed up here. Use the maximum. Use the maximum. Use the max. Okay, let's get everyone back out. We need to craft some more band-aids. Uh, what was that under? Was that under here? Or is it under, I think it's under this. Here we go. Do we have enough? All right, let's just craft... Yeah, we're going to craft 50 of those, and then we're going to go back to equipped here and get everyone healed up because that dragon or whatever that was really did a number on us. All right, Daver's healed up. Fubar, we need to get you up to maximum. Klar, let's get you healed up. Owen, let's get you healed up. All right, Lisbeth and Nane. All right, so everyone's back up to full force. Get them out here. Take care of this dragon. I need that. Where's our mage? Nane, I need you if your mage staff to come back and zappy zappy. Looks like he's on this side now. That flame is just doing damage. I wonder if they're in the water, if that stops the, the fire. Come on. We need archers here too. Because he is just lighting everything on fire. New creature. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Daylight's coming. Let's see if he retreats here soon. Yeah, we don't have any range. Okay, Nane's zapping him with the staff. Uh, all right, let's get everyone inside because that's not doing anything good. All right, we knocked him down. And, oh my god, uh, there's even more. All right, everyone get back into attack mode. Those guys are fighting those. Um, they're getting chased away. Looks like we're kind of winning. All right, let's go back and use up some, uh, some of these band-aids. Heal... Heal, 
Jeez Louise, this is not how the episode I thought it was gonna go. I thought this was gonna be a pretty peaceful episode and here we are fighting a freaking dragon. All right, Owen's back up. Elena, Elizabeth, uh, Nain. All right, everyone's sort of healed back up. That fire's still burning. It's destroying some of our stuff, but that's okay. These guys are charging back into combat. We're knocking these goblins out little bit by little bit. Another goblin down. Looks like this bridge is gonna burn. Our door burned down here. Um, they're gonna flank us, it looks like. I don't know what they're trying to do here. All right, you guys need to be combat. Don't worry about gathering resources now. All right, let's knock out that guy. And then extinguish, extinguish, extinguish. All right, let's go back to balanced here. That fire's spreading. Oh, it's burning everything. All right, let's get all this extinguish. Yeah, there you guys go. Extinguish. Um, why can't we put this out? Extinguish. All right, so oh, we got some goblins down here and some rats. So let's go down there and take care of that. We'll put that there and we'll have to craft a new door in a second. All right, one less goblin. I think we just got this guy here and then we'll have to take care of these rats here. Not that. There you go, beat those rats up and their little nest. Oh wow, that was, that was something. Um, so they destroyed the rat's nest. Let's go in here. And I'm glad we survived. Where's the door at? Where is the door at? We need to build a new door. Door, door, door. Where are you at? Why am I missing you? All right, let's just go ahead and craft ourselves a new door. Drop that there. Well, I'm glad we did some fortifying. It might have helped. I have no clue. I think we need to, do we need to dig the ash? All right, population growth plus one. So one of our dwarves came back. And then let's just go ahead and put that there, close that up. We got that rebuilt and that should refortify everything or remake the house whole. Okay, good. That's complete. Um, this guy's still attacking. Let's go take care of him. Um, yeah, no one's really in the mood to go into combat. So let's go into equipped here. All right. So he needs X and what is he as a carpenter. So we're just going to go with the steel club and then the iron pick. Let's see if anyone else is new. Singrids came back. Let's get him re-equipped here. Iron Axe. So I think we lost two? Use, okay. Swimmer, Carpenter, and this is a smithing apron. Let's go find our smith. Uh, did we lose our smith? Oh, okay, we must have lost our smith. All right, so everyone's healing back up. Set everyone on the war path. Let's go attack him. I don't know why they're not gonna go attack him. They're all just kind of standing about. Some types of work are prohibited. All right, I guess we're not going to attack him. They're just going to hang out. That's okay. Glad we took out that dragon. Jeez, Louise, Papa Cheese. All right, let's clean all this up. Cut that down. Cut that down. I feel like there's a fire burning still somewhere. Guess not. All right, they're going to clean all that up. Looks like they need to finish that over there. Ten minutes till the big attack. Hopefully everyone gets nice and rested up. We'll probably need to craft some more food here. So, oh, we got some nut and berry salads left. So let's go and put some of those out. Drop some more down there. All right, balanced. Got those there. He's still chipping away. I don't know why. Oh, because the door got closed. Open. Now we should be able to go attack him. Let's see, attack. There they go. Nope, maybe not. They're going to go craft some food. All right, so let's select, and then we're gonna go equipped, and we'll just use that last band-aid on him, get him healed up. I wonder if there's a hole in the bridge. They all keep falling there. All right, down goes that goblin, the zombie coming in. Oh, all right, I think we've uh, restabilized. Let's get some more defenses up, and we're gonna go, what do we wanna go with? Maybe some spikes? Or do I want to go fences? All right, so let's see what these say. Simple fence slows down enemies, advance a little bit. And wooden spikes uh, delay damage attacking monsters. Um, okay, so yeah, we're going to go spikes definitely. And we'll make, let's make five of those and close out. And then let's go ahead and put some spikes there. And then maybe a spike. Okay, well, let's get rid of those mushrooms and we can put a spike there. All right, let's go back to balanced. 
All right, that's cleaned up. Do I want to leave that ladder there? No, let's get rid of that ladder. Put a spike there. And then can we put some spikes in the bridge? Yeah. All right, we'll do that like that. Ghost is coming in. I'll take care of that ghost. Cut down that tree. Well, this again has not gone the way I wanted it to go, but we survived. We got new hero available. Um, Umards, Barry Tinkerton, Burner, uh, Fire Skills, uh, Kitchen is Punishment. He's like, right, bro, foes in good state. Hmm, maybe we'll have to eventually buy one of these heroes. We got enough. We've got enough indeed. We got some guys coming this way. Let's take them out. Smashy, smashy, all those skeletons. All right, those skeletons are gone. Got any more coming this way? One more. Let's go ahead and click on him. Big old guy coming. Where are they coming from? They must have a spawn point or something over there. Hmm. Whatever, he's gone. Go us, go team, rah, rah, rah. If you've been enjoying this video, because it's been crazy, you know, go ahead and leave a like. Comment on down below if you've been enjoying Craft the World. I sure know I have been. It's been an exciting game. It's uh, not what I expected, but in a good way. Uh, like I said in the first video, I played a little bit back in like 2014, 15, something like that, when it first came out. A bunch of DLCs have come out since then. Uh, I have all the DLCs running right now. And we're kicking butt and taking names, uh, as well as we can, at least. All right, let's go ahead and open that hatch so they can take that ladder out. Um, what was it? Okay, we were killing some sheep to get string, but what were we? Oh, we were going to make the fishing pole. All right, so let's go ahead and craft ourselves. We did get a lot of rope from the battles, it looks like. So let's go, and we're going to make... All right, since we need more range, we're going to craft one bow... And let's craft one fishing pole. And then maybe maybe a backpack? Float. Oh, bucket of worms. That'll help with the fishermen. And maybe, yeah, let's go ahead and craft a backpack. All right, and let's go ahead and equip some of that now. Now, who do we want to be our archer? Maybe Sigrid? Yeah, he's going to be our archer. So let's, oh, it needs to be crafted. J, K, let's go back and we're gonna let that run for a second. All right, knock that ladder out, that's good. We've got some food down here, he's making that bow. Let's go ahead and craft some more bandages and get everyone healed up here while we're just kind of standing around. We got plenty of leaves, water, and resin. So let's just make a solid 50 bandages. Uh, we should probably collect up some more water, so let's get it from here. And then maybe there and there, gather up that water. All right, they're gonna get all that for us. Fantastic, guys. So let's go into equipped here. All right, we got that bow. And I think we wanted to do Sigrid. Yeah, all right, so we're gonna give him the bow. Perfect, so he's got the bow and arrows and he's ready to let those arrows fly to knock out that dragon if it comes back. All right, glue is now healed up. And let's get Sigrid healed up. All right, he is healed up. All right, Sana, Daver. Okay, Fubar, Owen needs some help here. We'll get him patched up. Elena, Lisbeth needs a little bit. And then Nain's good, but we'll just make sure. Perfect. All right, so let's get the fisherman a bucket. Now, do we have a fisher? We do, we have two fishers. Um, so let's give that to Daver. I guess you're gonna be our fisherman. And now can we equip him with the pole? No, okay, so it must be just automatic. Automatic indeed. Now we got some extra boots, so let's go ahead and get those equipped as well. Boop and boop, and let's see if anyone else needs some shoes. Okay, everyone's got armored boots. That's good, or wooden boots. And then let's give the backpack to, um, I guess we're just going to give it to Geralt there so he can carry a little bit more for us. All right, and we'll back out of that screen. All right, so they'll collect all that water up for us. He's got that backpack and fishing, so let's go ahead and trigger that to fish. And I forgot who we gave the fishing pole to or the fishing bucket to. Hopefully one of them comes and does that. They're just standing here chit-chatting. In the rain, how embarrassing. Chop that tree down, cut that down. 
All right, I think... Oh, he didn't fall. Okay, and we got some fishing going on. All right, let's see if he catches anything. Do, 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 do. And he caught something. Good for him. Okay, so now we got a good source of fishing. I wonder if eventually we should almost, like, barricade. Yeah, we'll close that out. Thank you. I wonder if we should, like, barricade this and then, like, have this as, like, maybe we can put some archers and turn this into a kill zone. Yeah, maybe eventually we do that. And we got another Santa suit and some wreaths. All right, so they're going to go up and collect that for us. Okay, we've got 2 minutes and 55 seconds to that next attack. I really don't want to do much else other than survive that next attack. And, oh, wait, no. And cut down that berry bush there. All right, let's go ahead and get that water from up there. Because if we go down here and start clearing all this out, you know, by the time we get down there, we got 2 minutes left now, that attack is going to be here. So let's just have everyone hang out. Maybe we'll get some more food out. We got four fish fillets, so we can make some grilled fish, which we need oil for. Man, um, we still need to finish up basic processing. Okay, so let's make, let's go to craft here, and maybe we make some glass bottles. We need coal and glass. We'll make 10 of those. Okay, that got, that got a lot of basic processing done, and then maybe some clay. Um, yeah, let's make 10 clay. So that should finish up basic processing here. All right, so now we have unlocked. We got basic fortification. We've already done all that. Slide this over. We're working on fishing right now. So we got advanced construction, so we can build new roofs, some scaffolding, the wooden bridge, and those housings, okay. Some advanced illumination, miner's lamp, light stand, portable lamp. Okay, 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 I like it, I like it. And then that's gonna get us into basic decorating, advanced processing, advanced furnishing, expert furnishing. Oh, we're just coming right along. Kingdom of Earthbringers is kicking butt and taking names, my friends. So looks like they're gonna come down here and make us some bottles. We got about a minute 45 left. So let's just go ahead and chop these trees down while we wait for the next attack. We'll do the fishing here. Have those trees chopped down. Just keep everyone nice and close and nearby for when this portal opens. Minute and 10 seconds to that. All right, how we? what else have we got going on? Nothing's really changing down below the ground. So I think we leave that like that. They're collecting all those resources. I wonder if we maybe put some more spikes on this bridge. Yeah, let's do that. Um, all right, wooden spikes. And let's just craft 10. Yeah, we'll just make 10. And we're going to go do, do, do. And we're just going to put spikes all the way across this bridge. Uh, spikes, traps. And we'll do a spike here and a spike there. Just slow these guys down. 20 seconds in the home stretch. Hopefully they can put the rest of these spike tracks up. Looks like we got one down there. These are almost up. One more. They're carrying. All right, where's the monster portal coming from? All right, so actually let's bring everyone in. And we're going to set everyone to attack. And we'll just wait for them to come this way. Or do we want to meet them at the... I think we wait and maybe force them to come up. Yeah, they're going to chop through all those spikes. That's going to take them a little bit of time. Yeah. Hopefully once they get into range, like right here. I wish there was a way. Let me know in the comments if there's a way to like rally dwarves. Like if I could rally them right here... And then I could have like the archer and the mage up here, like I said, just like raining arrows and lightning down and have the the warriors right here at the door. Man, I wish there was a way to do, I wish I was, there was a way to do that. Yeah, we're under attack. I got it. I got it. Hopefully once they start jumping up here, uh, looks like they're taking damage. That's good from the spikes. Now is there a, no, we don't want to do that right now. Um, all right, let's see. Let's just have them go. All right, we're going to rush. I see the archer and the mage in the background, bolts flying, arrows flying, everyone's getting stabbed and shocked. Got one big guy, two big guys, looks like the main boss and the big lurker, he goes down. Some extra skeletons coming up as reinforcements, we'll take care of them. Um, Alright, I think we pushed back the portal folks, got a couple zombies staggering our way, that all got knocked out. Check the other side. Anyone coming this way? Uh, there's a ladder. I wonder if that's from the goblins earlier. I think that's from the goblins area. All right, well, let's go ahead and put it on balanced. We'll take out this zombie. We'll put in these 
uh, spikes again. I need to make two more spikes. All right, that last zombie's gone. And we survived the portal attack and that dragon attack. That was quite a bit that we had to face. Take out that sheep to get his wool. So if you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it, comment. Wow, quite a bit happened in this episode, but that's okay. We survived. A couple new dwarves came in, a couple died, but that's a part of combat. That's a part of battle. Uh, and then don't forget to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming if you want to get all this great content on time in an orderly fashion. Not only do we have Craft the World going on, we got Mini Metro, we've got uh, Overcrowd, a couple other games working. So if this isn't your thing, there's plenty of other games for you to come out and see. Thank you so much for joining me today, and we'll see you in the next Craft the World video.